Hallo, ik is Eti. Welkom bij mijn kanaal waar ons alles saam doen. Since I was very young, I enjoyed creating new games. Often it was things like puzzle games based on snakes and ladders or Monopoly or a combination of things like that. And I would draw pictures and create little worlds and create rules and steps for the game and how to do this and I enjoyed the creation of this new world and this new process. And then I made my sister play the games with me. Because <laughs> I think she often didn't really want to, but she did. Um, so a great thanks to her. Um, and I've always enjoyed logic puzzles and word puzzles and, you know, anything that I need to solve. Uh, I still do. I still, that's, that's the book I take to the beach with me. Um... And then I, I lie there and I do things like Sudoku and anything that's a puzzle that you have to solve. I really enjoy that. And so based off all of that, I thought, what better way to introduce vocabulary to people and to help them memorize it than a word game? This game is very simple. <laughs> it's, I would explain it as a combination between a crossword puzzle and Scrabble. It's really nothing fancy. Um, it's just a simple way to test the level of vocabulary that you know um, and to learn your words and to have some fun at the same time. You can use it as a benchmark to see how far you've come with your vocabulary, um, to measure how many of these words you truly know. And if you see that you really struggle with this game, the words that I've used in the game is from my vocabulary videos um, on my channel. So if you really struggle and you see you don't really know um, much or any of the words, then you can go back to those videos, watch them, learn the vocabulary, and then retest your skill set after a while. Um, so without further ado, let me explain the rules of the game, and I hope you guys have fun. Who varg? How does the game work? I give you six letters at the top of the screen. You have to keep in mind that there is always one imposter letter that is not used at all in any of the words within those six letters. So you are only going to use five of the letters and one must be ruled out completely. Now you create a three-letter or a four-letter word from the five remaining letters. You can create both the three- and four-letter word if you can find them both. Or you can create just one, the three- or the four-letter word. You earn more points if you create both. You can use the letters from the remaining five letters more than once. So they can be overlap. The letters used in the three-letter word can be used in the four-letter word as well. Just as long as there is one letter from the overall six given that you don't use at all. So how do you go about finding the words? I am going to give you a hint that is made up of words for both the three-letter word and the four-letter word. Then I'm also going to give you a hint that is a picture for both the three-letter and the four letter word. Now you can then pause the video and take as much time as you need to find one or both of the words. You earn one point for the three letter word and two points for the four letter word. All the words in this game comes from these five vocabulary videos that you can find on my channel. At the end of this video, I give you all the answers. The maximum amount of points you can earn is 48. And that is if you get all the three-letter and the four-letter words. I'm going to read through these words with you. So at the top, you'll see we've got your first six letters. So that is O, N, O, R, T. <laughs> That's the phonetic pronunciation. Um, remember, one of the letters you will not use at all. So always keep that in mind that one letter must be thrown out completely. 
Uh, so on the left, we've got the three letter word. The hint is a lichaamsteel, which is a body part. The hints in, <laughs> in this video sometimes are a little bit vague. Um, I didn't want to just give away the answer. So um, sometimes you'll have to think slightly out of the box with the hints, um, but not always. So then you've got the picture. So that picture is supposed to help you choose <laughs> which, which body part you're looking for. <laughs> um, and then we've got the four letter word. Vier letter woord. Ook a lichaamsteel. And then you have the picture of the feet. <laughs> okay. The second group of letters. On the left you have the three letter word hint again. A lichaamsteel. Which is a body part. And the same picture of the boy. And on the right we have the four letter word. And the hint there is bloot which is blood. And the picture, that's a picture of platelets, blood platelets. The third group of letters. For the three letter word, we have a lichaamsteel, again. Um, and then that is a picture of a hook. One of those hooks that you have hanging from the ceiling um, that you can hook something to. And the four letter word hint is vi in die wind. Blow in the wind. And then the picture is a hairdryer. Group four. The three letter word. Jy gebruik dit om kost te maak. You use it to make food. And the picture is of the color black. Vier letter woord. Jy vind jou hartklop daar. And the picture is of a wristwatch. Letters five. Drie letter woord. Dit beskerm jou lyf. It protects your body. And then you've got the picture there of what seems the skin and hair. And then the four letter word. Suis di son. Like the sun. And that is a picture of a duck. Group six. Three letter word, yo brain se huis, your brain's house. And below that, you've got a picture of a house. And the four letter word, in van die stappe voor jy kan eet. One of the steps before you can eat. And the picture is of a chef. Group seven, three letter word, jy kan goed in dit sit. You can put things in it. And the picture is a salad bowl, filled with salad. Four letter word. Waar jou darms blij. Where your intestines stay. And then below that, you've got a picture of a human body and what goes on inside. Group eight. Three letter word. Dit help jou in die donker. Helps you in the dark. And then you've got a picture of the sun. And four letter word. Jy kan uit dit drink. You can drink from it. And then the picture there is of shards of glass or broken glass. Groep nege. Drie letter woord. Sneeuw. Um, and below that you have a picture of snow. <laughs> Vier letter woord. Orgaan wat deel is van infecties bestrijd. Organ that is part of fighting infections. And that below that, you have a picture of an organ. Groep 10, drie letter woord. Ondersteun jou kop. Support your head. And below that, you've got a picture of a giraffe. And then, <laughs> four letter word, ruik, which is smell. And below that, you've got a picture of a box of tissues. Group 11. Drie letter woord. Achter. And then you've got a picture of a person from behind. And vier letter woord. London se lucht. London sky. 
And below that, you've got a picture of shapes. Group 12. Drie letter word. Snij. Cut. And that is a picture of a finger that has a cut in it. Vier letter word. Was. And there you've got a picture of a basin with a lot of bubbles. Groep 13. Braai, which is to fry. And below that, you've got a picture of a chef working in the kitchen. And then, vier letter word, bluus, which is blush. And below that, you've got a picture of a girl blushing. Groep 14. Drie letter word. Dit het dure. It has doors. Below that, you've got a picture of a lot of clothes. And then, vier letter word, slaan, hit. And then below that, you've got two, two hands um, that seems to be fighting. Groep 15, drie letter word, sport. And you've got a picture of a mountain with snow on it. And then, vier letter word, lichaamsteel, body part. And then you've got a picture of a person with knee guards. Group 16. Drie letter word. Lichaamsteel. And then you've got a picture of two hands that seems to be preparing to wrestle, arm wrestle. And then vier letter word. Pomp. And then you've got a picture of a person. And again, it's the inside of the body. This then brings us to the end of all of the words. Here you have the words on the screen. Um, there are 32 words in total. And if you found them all, you will have a score of 48. So I'm going to read through the words just so that you can hear the pronunciation again um, and check your answers. All right, so we start with drie letter woorden. Oor. Oog, hak, pot, vel, kop, bak, lich, wit, nek, rug, mes, pan, kas, ski, arm. Alright, so those are all 16 of the three letter words. If you've got them all, congratulations. <laughs> you've earned 16 points. Um, if you didn't get them all, that's 100% fine. Um, then you now know the things that you can go back and work on. Um, with something like this, with a word game, it's not just vocabulary, but it also expands your brain's capacity to think in that language and to think more extensively in a foreign language. Um, because it's obviously way more difficult to think in a second, third or fourth language when given hints like this um, that is indirect and not, and not saying, oh, well, what is the word for your foot in Spanish? Or what is the word for a pillow in English? It's one of those things where it involves other ways of thinking and your brain has to work in a different way, um, which I think will expand your language skills um, in the long term. One video is not enough. <laughs> this one game is obviously not enough, um, but I think it's a, it's a good place to start. All right, and then let's look at the four-letter words. So I'll start at the top with tuen. Tuen, roi, hare, pols, geel, kook, buik, Glas, malt, neus, grijs, sip, wang, box, knie, hart. And if you got them all, you'll have earned another 32 points. Um, well done to those of you who got everything. That's amazing. Um, if you've struggled, that's also cool because that's how we learn. Um, I hope you guys enjoy that game. Um, <laughs> I know it was very, it was very simple and, you know, not 
anything new. There's a lot of weird games that are like that. Um, but I hope I hope you enjoyed it and you learned something from it. And this is a tool that you can use to test your vocabulary and to expand your mind's ability to understand and communicate in Afrikaans. Um, I hope you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you in the next video. And thank you. Thank you so much for playing this game with me.